been here the uh, Mikey have been here in Charlotte with uh, Tyler Venables. Tyler, what uh, you working out with DBs today? Is that right? Yes, sir. DBs. I know last year you had to make switch and go under center there. Daniel, what do you what do you think is going to be your positions this year? Well, I'm going to play uh, both ways this year. So, you know, get my conditioning up and just uh, work on throwing the ball and then you know work on my uh, man to man skills. Dad's not going to let you drop that defense, is it? Oh no, he's going to let me play both. <laughs> you know, he wants me on both. He wants me on the field all the time. What's uh, what's it been like for you this year? Obviously, your dad had some schools that looked at him, and I talked to your brother Jake a lot, and he was glad that you guys were obviously staying in the area. Mm -hmm. Are you glad all that settled and yes, sir. Uh, you get I mean, to stay there? Home? He, didn't, he didn't really talk about it at home. He wasn't worried about it. Um, he didn't want to bring that stress home and like, put it on us. And he wasn't really interested. In, you know, he wasn't too interested in those schools. He was happy where he is right now at Clemson. How hands-on is Dad? Obviously, you got the best coach you can talk to in the living room every night. Uh, teach you things and how hands on is he with you? I mean, I know, I know freaking uh, safety skills all the way into pass rushing skills because of my brother. He, right. would, he would late night, 10 o'clock, he would be working on uh, hands and pass rushing moves with my dad, uh, and, you know, freaking stomping on the ground. And then, you know, he's teaching me man to man skills about what to do with my hands. So you learn a lot of that from Jake, not just your father. Yes, sir. Both, both Jake and my dad. Uh, were you there yesterday, I guess, spring game? I was. What were your thoughts there? Pretty hot. Uh, quarterbacks was pretty interesting to watch. It was, it was fun to uh, watch. Um, and then I thought Kayvon Wallace kind of showed out in defense. He was he's a really good uh, safety. And then you got your offer from Clemson there recently. What was that like for you? Just you know, it's exciting to you know just like have that feeling of all your work paying off, but then not getting satisfied and you know trying to get as many as you can. Just you know working to be the top uh, top athlete in the class. What's an event like this help you? How's it today help you? It's just you know being out here competing. Um, Meeting new guys, just working on my skill. Your boy Ty's been working a little bit today. I'm sorry, Ty Boyd over there working today. Uh, you to you yet? I haven't seen him. I haven't seen him. Yeah, he's over there working with the quarterbacks. Uh, last question for you: What's it like uh, being a coach's son and having to go through all that? It's just there's a lot of like unexpected pressure uh, that's put on you, but you know, I don't want to make demons that aren't there. That uh, you know, not everybody thinks of that as me, um, and you know, just not a lot of people know that. Well, you, you, we were talking about Amigo. You and I went fishing when your dad first came to Clemson. Yes, sir. How much does your dad just love the area and love the fishing? I know he loves the fishing versus the golf. And oh, yeah. He's the Clemson he's, area. He's not a golfer, but, you know, we, we were in Oklahoma, and he's, everything's flat, you know. There's, not, there's no lakes, uh, no mountains, no hills, nothing. So it's, it's a good area here.